my mom actually sent me a picture of her earlier. She goes, well, is this the dog? Because I guess the story came across her Facebook at some point. She's been making her way around. It's an animal world out there. Watch the World Animal Awareness Society channel and feel right at home. Come, sit, subscribe, and stay a while. Are you okay? You're not okay. Let's be going. It's okay. We're gonna help you, okay? A girl or a boy? A girl. A girl? Yeah. Oh, perfect. I don't know if she's spayed or not. I haven't even looked for a space car or anything. I'm going to assume that she's not. Perfect. Bye. She's in the nice. I'll probably go ahead and express her better. Okay. She's been too scared to pay people. Okay. Cat.
Embarrassing. You drop the smallest particle possible and her nose is going to get it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Everything else is not getting any attention. <laughs> you put fresh food in my, is there fresh food in my house? Beagle? <laughs> I promise I'll give you. I think I'm going to stay here. She's going to be funny. When she gets her personality, she's going to be funny. Her nightly pills. She's on two antibiotics, two things. But as long as it's in snacks, it's it's been very easy to medicate her as you can see. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> Thank you for loving Robin. In true fashion, um, I couldn't get in my front door today when I got back from my conference. Um, I'm pretty sure the Amazon driver thought we rescued a bunch of birds again. Um, but this time it wasn't birds, right? It's for Robin. Um, and of course I started crying, right? And my husband comes out and he's like, what in the world? Because they all got delivered after he got home. Um, and so, yes, I couldn't get in my front door. And so I have some thank yous to say. I have all of the products 
that arrived just today um, behind me. So we have some thank yous. Um, first is Peggy Gardner and Peggy, um, she has show Wheatons that I used to groom and has always supported me no matter where I've been. And so Peggy, um, thank you for the dog food and the, I'm, I'm reading the papers here, um, for the dog food and, oh gosh, there are lots of papers. Hold on. Fingers work. Um, oh, I guess the other papers that tell what you ordered. I just opened everything. I was so excited. Um, yes. Um, Peggy sent several items from Robin's wish list. So thank you, Peggy. Um, to Karen uh, Donham, who is a fe fellow um, NIA person and uh, in the chambers with me, um, they own Ranger AC. Um, and she is just an absolutely wonderful person. Thank you for sending Robin dog food. Um, Amy Flores, thank you for sending colloidal silver cream, uh, for Robin. Um, she says, sending love and peace for the sweet girl. Um, yes, very much so. Um, to Cynthia Foster, thank you for sending dog food and a collar for her. Um, she, her skin is really bad. She had a skin infection and all the scabs are falling off. So she's going to go through a couple collars because, um, her skin is so gross right now. Um, so, so for everyone that sent collars, she's going to need them. Uh, so we appreciate everyone that has sent the Martingale collars for her. Um, Chris sent, there's multiple boxes. Um, the colloidal silver cream and the training pads. Um, thank you very much, Chris. Um, when I stopped in and saw Robin today, um, we figure it's going to be at least 10 weeks. Um, so of us having to apply the colloidal silver cream and stuff like that to her wounds. Um, and she has so many of them. So having all of these available is going to be life-saving because, um, we're going to be using a lot of it because of the number of wounds that she has. Okay. So to Lisa, David, Lydia, Isabel, Baldwin, and Luna and Ruby and Velma, thank you very much uh, for your gift to Robin. Uh, Greenies Pill Pockets and Natural Dog Company Paw Soother, which is going to be amazing. Um, oh, and Silver Miracles Colloidal Silver Cream and um, the First Aid Roll Gauze. Um, so yes, thank you, especially to Luna and Ruby and Velma. Please give them a hug for us. And then next, we have uh, Mark and Maureen Johnson, who I know through the chamber um, work that I've done. Um, Mark and Maureen, they have two beautiful labs um, that they have rescued. And they sent the dog crate mat um, and the Band-Aid brand, um, the rolled gauze. So thank you, I'm double checking. Yes, thank you uh, for those from Mark and Maureen. I appreciate you. Um, Ralph, are these all Ralph? Um, as I'm looking through, um, for Claudio Silver Cream and the Paw Soother, thank you very much. Um, there's this poor girl. I'm telling you guys what, even though I continue to read off that those were sent, we are going to use up all of it. I can guarantee that. Um, okay, this is from this one does not have this one does not have a person 
and this one does not have a person. Both of them are um, the rolled gauze. So I have two different ones. Maybe they're the same person, but they did not have one of these papers with them to tell me who they were from. So if you sent them, know that we said thank you. Let us know in the comments um, so that way we can say a shout out to you um, just like we are everybody else because we want to know every single person to know how much we appreciate them. Um, from Melinda, Melinda didn't put a last name. Uh, Colloidal Silver Cream. Thank you, Melinda. Um, if I knew your last name, I know several Melindas, um, I would uh, give you a shout out. Um, to Deidre, um, she was in my LMC class, Leadership Montgomery County, and she is a true leader in our community, and I love her and her mama. Um, so thank you very much, Paw Soother, um, the uh, Moonsea um, dog pads um, for the crate, and also um, for Colloidal Silver Cream. So thank you, Deidre and Mama. Um, for sending a gift to Robin. So thank you everyone so far that has given. I know a lot of people have commented and said that items are coming. So I'm only going to assume that my door will look the same tomorrow uh, as they do today. And um, a little secret, she gets to blow that popsicle stand tomorrow. She will be coming uh, into foster um, tomorrow. Uh, so she gets to leave the veterinary hospital. And then when I went and visited her today, um, she went on a really good walk and she's taking her pills orally, um, and doing really well. Um, so I'm just very, very excited, um, that all of the items are arriving today. So that way we're ready for tomorrow. So thank you, uh, to everyone that has donated so far, um, to, uh, either her medical bills or by getting products off of her wish list. It's very much appreciated. Um, and hopefully we'll have some videos of her coming home tomorrow. Thank you for rooting for Robin. Dad, I hear you recording for the World Awareness Society. What is that? Yeah, you mean World Animal Awareness Society? Well, I'm a volunteer with the World Animal Awareness Society, Emerson. I volunteer my voice for use in animal rescue videos. And I don't know if you know this, but everyone at the World Animal Awareness Society is a volunteer. But what do they do? They're award-winning volunteer filmmakers who have interacted with 2,200 animal welfare nonprofits, including Maddie's Fund and Austin Pets Alive, providing information-rich content to more than 45 countries in the last 10 years. Dad, what's that mean? Okay, Em, how about this? They make short movies about animals that are in peril, that are hurting, you know, in bad shape or dying or homeless in the streets. They film rescuers doing heroic work so they can focus on saving lives. The World Animal Awareness Society posts the rescue videos on social media, and then they're broadcast on TV sharing the heroic stories with people all over the world so they can understand what's really going on. Cool. I like animals. How did you start volunteering? Well, I met their director through social media and saw the work that they were doing and knew that I could help their cause. So I asked if I could volunteer. I am very fortunate to have really great jobs providing the voice to so many shows that I believe it's important to give back. Since I've been volunteering with the World Animal Awareness Society, they have created the seventh most influential YouTube channel for dog rescue lovers in the world, WA2S Films. That's so cool. Hey dad, nice job. Do you think I could volunteer too? You already are, Em. You already are. You're watching the World Animal Awareness Society. Yep, that'll do, Emerson. That'll do. You're watching the World Animal Awareness Society. 